hadn't actually planned on making a video today, but I wanted to show you all of my goodies that I got out of the garden today. Last time I got beans, I probably got about five and we just snacked on them um, while we were outside in the garden. So this is exciting that I might actually be able to cook these and, uh, and have a decent size portion meal tonight. Maybe I'll just stick them in the bag in the fridge and wait for a couple of days until some more of these green beans get mature. But um, today's the first day that I'm actually getting harvest out of the garden. It's very exciting. Also, my champagne bubbles are finally coming ripe. So I'm going to grab a couple bunches of those as well. Along with my champagne bubble tomatoes and my beans, I also have like three cucumbers that are ready and some peppers. Cucumbers always seem to come and come fast. Those little peppers, I think those are jalapenos. They kind of look like it. They got the shape for it. these peppers. It's funny, funny shape. This little pepper. It's tiny. This one's kind of funny as shaped. I might actually take that today because it's got a funny hole in it. Also, several ground cherries are coming ripe. Normally, you're supposed to let the ground cherries fall to the ground and then harvest them off the ground. That's where they get their name. But when they turn yellow like this, I just like to pick them. Pick them, not plick them pick them off of the vine. That way I don't have to reach around so hard. Uh oh, where did that one go? That is a pretty good little haul for my ground cherries. I actually think I might let this one go one more day see a little bigger. I cannot get over how pretty these candy striped zinnias are. I think it's funny that the cucumber's holding on to it too. I thought I had another squash coming right, but been digging around in these squash plants all morning and I have not seen it so maybe I was maybe I was mistaken These are just a little bit green on the bottom. So I'm gonna let the other branch go for another day at least. It's funny, the season hasn't even really got started. Like I haven't really been in full swing yet. It's just starting to get started. And I'm already thinking about 
how I want to uh, design my garden for next year. I have better ideas on where I want to put things so I have a little more space to move around because right now it's really tight. I think I need some sharp scissors too. I mean, with all these lessons that I've learned, um, the only way to, to grow from here is by taking those lessons and putting them to use. So next year, I'm definitely going to be um, planting different. I don't think I'm gonna do corn next year. I'm gonna have to try to talk my husband out of, uh, out of making me do corn because I just think it takes up space and, um, and we're not gonna get very much corn out of our corn that we're growing go away. So um, I don't think I'm going to do corn and instead I'm going to plant my squash plants where the corn is on that row over there on that fence row and then I'm going to put some arch trellises and grow my cucumbers up the arch trellises next to where the squash are and then I'll go from there. But I'm also uh, the space here that I'm sitting in is a lot of wasted space and um, so next year I'm gonna use that space uh, better to my best abilities um, to fill in my whole garden, but still leave me some walking space and of course somewhere that I can uh, store all my tools and things. So um, learning, learning, learning every day and as you go and uh, nothing wrong with that, right? I think I'm gonna grab this last pepper and then I'm going to head inside. It's getting hot and my dogs all like to be out here with me. You can see Bubba right there. And then, who's that? Colby and Riley is laying in the weeds here. So, of course, Raven's up by the door ready to go inside. So I'm going to clip this last pepper and then we are all going to take our butts inside and cool off. Um, I thank you guys for hanging out with me and um, learning from my mistakes along with me and helping me with, um, with things that help you. And I really appreciate um, all your inputs. And I will talk to you in the next video. Bye guys.